So today we have this electric circuit. This electric circuit has been designed to test the electrical conductivity of the liquid. So we can see here battery is here and this is the switch is there, conducting wires are there and in place of bulb we have this LED. LED is there so this LED will detect a small amount of current because liquids are generally poor conductor of electric currents. Now here the resistor is there. So this electric circuit has been designed to test the electrical conductivity of these four liquids. Acidic basic solution is there, acidic solution is there, well is there and distilled water is there. So one by one we will test their electrical conductivity and we will find that whether the bulb glows or not. So first we will dip the circuit in the distilled water, dip it, it in distilled water. Yes, we have dipped in distilled water and we find that the bulb does not glow. The bulb does not glow, so distilled water is the non-conductor of electric current. Then keep it in the well. So here also we, we find that we find that the bulb does not glow. The bulb does not glow at all. So this liquid is also the non-conductor of electric currents. The bulb does not glow then keep it in the acidic solutions now this time we find that the bulb glows acidic solution in case of acidic solution we find that the bulb glows so acidic solution is a conductor of electric currents we, we can see clearly the bulb glows yes now keep it in basic solution this time also if we see the bulb glows suggesting that the basic solutions are conductor of electric current so here are the electrical conductivity of four liquids these two are conducting basic and acidic solution are conducting and well and this distilled water are the non-conductor of electric current